Carlton a nil all draw away to Cove you know a point gained two points dropped maybe if you look at it the other way I um, suppose the positive thing for you now you got your debut out of the way you're happy to come into the team yeah first first of all I'm delighted to get my debut it's been a long time coming I suffered a uh, off slightest fuse and it's just it's just it's just been rehab since then and I'm happy to get back but most importantly we have to take the positives here like it's a it's a tough they're, t they're a good side like and it's a tough place to try and pick up three points but Ultimately, I still thought we tried to play well. Maybe we could have done a few things differently, but we have to take the positives. It's still one point away from home, so I'm happy enough for that. You touched on your injury there. You know, we won't go into too much detail, but it has been a long, grueling road for you to get back to full fitness. But yeah. tonight, you know, you showed you, you you weren't rusty at all. I thought you made a difference when you came in. You had a chance there at the end, nearly as well. You put yeah. forced to save. So, are you happy with your performance in the last twenty? Uh, I'm just I'm happy to be back playing. First, first and foremost, I thought that I had a chance before that maybe. I, I tried to play it in and maybe I should have went myself but uh, I'm happy most importantly, most importantly just to be back playing um, um, I do hope to I still, I'm still not as fit as um, I'd want to, I'd want to be I'd want to be 100% so I'd, I'd want to get to that and want to show the club what I can do because that's the main, main thing there's been like I've been out for a while so it's most importantly for me to come back and just try and show what I can do and try and help the team to keep up the momentum. Just talking about breaking into the team, you know, Neil was a fan of you from when you were on loan at Galway, you know, you, yeah. I, I, I thought you impressed against us as well. I think you scored against us actually. Yeah. Um, so Neil obviously was keeping an eye on you and then when you got you got the call and you came to Longford and then the injury came, you know, how hard was it to, you know, to stay positive just to keep focusing on training? Well, I, I was delighted to sign here because it's a great, it's a great set up here and then and like just we just play great football, so I was delighted with that. And then with the injury, it's just a bit of a it was a bit of a nightmare. So it was because uh, moving to a new club and again injured. But to be fair, like Neil, Neil and the staff, they've kept, they've kept faith in me and they've they've pushed me to get back fit. And I'm I'm just I can't be any more I can't be any thankful to them like because they've done everything they could to try and get me back. And I'm delighted that they gave me a chance and kept faith in me. So I hope to re reward them now in the next while and hopefully do something good for the team. You came out on the wing tonight. Would you consider yourself an out-and-out -out winger? Is that your favourite position yeah, to play? Yeah, it is. It is an out-and-out -out winger would be my favourite position. Um, yeah, I'd be happy to play there. Like I'd, I'd be happy to play anywhere they got for us to play as long. As long as I'm getting minutes and doing what I can for the team, that's the main important thing for me. We look ahead to next week, you know, we have a tough game at home to Limerick. You know, we're still up around the top of the table, we're still unbeaten, so it's positive all round from the team. Yeah, all we can do is just look on to the next game and keep our heads down. Limerick are a good side, they're a good physical side as well, so it'll be at, it'll be at home as well. So it'll be a good, be a good game, but I, I can't wait, I can't wait, and hopefully I'll be in again to try and maybe show what I can do and try and help the team get three points. Good play, Thanks. Good man.